There's a fine line between right and wrong. And somewhere in the shadows, they send us in to find them. What is up and welcome back, it's Skovos bringing you another Call of Duty Modern Warfare video today. And in today's video, we just got the official announcement of the Season 2 Content and Battle Pass, which debuts tomorrow on February 11th. So let's go ahead and jump into these juicy details coming out with Season 2, starting off with the new multiplayer maps. So the maps we're going to be getting on day one are going to be Rust, Atlas Supersort, Zoka of Boneyard, and Bazaar. Bazaar and Rust will both be gunfight maps. Rust will also be a standard multiplayer map as well as Atlas Superstore. Zoka of Boneyard will be a new ground war map. And then later on in the season we're going to be getting Kandor Hideout which will be a standard multiplayer map as well. So the next thing on our list is going to be the new multiplayer modes coming in Season 2, and on Day 1, we will be getting the Gunfight Tournaments and the Call of Duty League playlists. This is going to be with Pro Rule Sets, so if you want to play by the Pro's rules, this is going to be the playlist for you. Later on in the season, we'll be getting Infected Ground War, different Gunfight Variants, a Night Vision Reinforced Game Mode, and Demolition. So on day 1 of season 2 if you purchase the premium battle pass you will also gain instant access to the new operator Ghost, he's returning from previous Call of Duty games. And later on in the season we will also gain access to 2 other new operators for a total of 3, these 2 new operators will be Talon and Mace. And last but not least, in Season 2 of Modern Warfare, we're going to be getting a total of 3 new weapons. The first 2 weapons on Day 1 are going to be available through the Battle Pass once you level it up, and they will be the Growl 556 and the Striker 45. Now the Striker 45 is very similar to the UMP which is a 45 caliber submachine gun. And then the Growl 556 is going to be a 556 assault rifle, something similar to the SWAT 556 from the Battlefield games. And then the new weapon later on in the season is probably going to be the M26 Mass Shotgun. It's going to have a different name, but it's going to be something along those lines. So the clip and screenshots in the background are going to be of one of the new operators, Mace. We already know what Ghost looks like, and this is not a skin from Ghost. The mask is a little bit different, and they are two entirely separate operators. So some things we can notice about Mace from the trailer and screenshots in the background is his mask is very metallic, it's held on by straps and is much shinier than Ghost's. He also has all of these markings on both of his arms. These appear to be some sort of like confirmed kill count so he could be some sort of bounty hunter. Either way the backstory behind this character has my interest peaked. And riding on the back of an ATV through one of the new maps, we do get a quick glimpse of one of the other new operators Talon which is coming later on in the season. Now I couldn't find out any more information about this operator except for one post on reddit that points out that he could be based on this real life navy seal seen in the image on screen now. So here we get a brief look at Rust, the new map coming to Modern Warfare, but a map we all know and love. We also get to see different operators in action, with different skins and weapon customization options. And just a reminder, Rust will be a standard multiplayer map, meaning all 6v6 game modes will be available to play on Rust, as well as the 2v2 game mode Gunfight. And as we can see from the screenshots in the background, the map has not changed almost at all, minus the graphic overhaul and the facelift of the environment, buildings, and color scheme, we can see that Rust is the map we all remember. And here we get a brief look at the Atlas Superstore. We can see that it's a close quarters map and it is cut away from the Special Ops mission, so you can actually hop into the Spec Ops mission right now to explore this map for yourself. We can assume there's probably going to be a little bit of changes and less verticality since it is a multiplayer map. So in the Season 2 gameplay trailer they mention this as new ways to play, but it's the night vision game mode that we already know and probably have experience in either love or hate. It's not really a new way to play, it's just them adding night vision into different playlists, different maps, and different game modes. So here we get to see some footage of the new map coming to the 2v2 gunfight game mode Bazaar, and since it's in that game mode we know that this map is going to be pretty small, and a bazaar is a small area like an alley or streetway full of small shops. We also get a glimpse of the operator's talent and mace, and then another view of Ghost. 
Next up, we get to see the Zokov Boneyard. This is going to be the new Ground War map in Season 2 of Modern Warfare, and this map will be available for everyone on Day 1. So that is going to wrap it up for this video on Season 2 of Call of Duty Modern Warfare. If you enjoyed this video and you want to see more like it, clicking that subscribe button goes a long way and helps me out a lot more than you may realize. If you enjoyed this video specifically, you can click the thumbs up. If you did not enjoy it, you can click the thumbs down as well. But whether you did click or didn't click any of the things that I mentioned, I still hope you have a good evening, afternoon, morning, night, or whatever it is, wherever you are. But thank you for stopping by and I hope to see you in one of my next videos.